Welcome to Linux Lab Tutorial. In this video, we are going to see how to install Zen Studio on Ubuntu. Zen Studio is the professional PHP IDE designed for business critical applications, which is simply known as Code Editor, which can allow you to create and edit codes. Zen Studio support PHP 7. Zen Studio has the faster performance, which can allow you to code faster and debug more easily. So it will be helpful for the programmers. It will be helpful for the programmers. So in this video, let me show you how to install Zen Studio on Ubuntu 16.04. First, we need to download the package for Zen Studio. For that, we can go to the Apache site for Zen Studio. Open your browser. Now here, type www.zen.com. Now hit enter. Now we can go to Zen Official website. Here we can download the package for Zen Studio. Now click here, download now. Here we will download the package for Zen Studio. Click here, download. Here you must choose the distribution. I am using Ubuntu. So I will choose Linux. And click download. Here you can see. To download the package, you must log in to send account. If you have your own account, you can log in. Otherwise, register for new account. And then, we can download the package. Since I have already done my download, so I am not going to download now. Now, I will open my terminal. And I go to download location. Here you can see, download the package for Zen Studio. Now we can start it using tar command. Type tar space hyphen xz vf space package name and then hit enter now it's extracting once the package is extracted you can see a new directory is created under your current directory the directory name is zen studio now move to the directory now hit enter now here you can see some of the files and directories to install zen studio we need to run the script file to run it, type dot slash and then file name Zen Studio. Now hit enter. Now here, choose a workspace. I will choose the default one. Now click OK. So now Zen Studio is opened. That's all about the installation of Zen Studio on Ubuntu 16.04. Hope this video is helpful for you. Thank you for watching.